Been a few hours, but it felt like days Only been days, but it felt like months Been gone for a year, only know like once Life moves fast when you do what you want I guess I'm doing what I want Hope you know what you want Welcome back to another video. So as the title suggests today we are going to do a Gikomba haul. I feel like we haven't done a Gikomba haul in such a long, long time. So we need to bring them back. Um, I recently went to Gikomba because I wanted to restock on my business. So for those who are new here, I have a thrift business called Stacy Thrifted Bags. I'm going to place the name of the page here. It's on Instagram. Uh, just follow it in case you don't find anything that I'm going to show you today. Uh, maybe you can, maybe you'll find something later. Or just follow for support. I'll really appreciate. Uh, so yeah, that's what's up. So the last Gikomba haul that I did, I had asked you guys if you were okay with me showing the bags here. Some of you were okay with it, some of you were not okay with it. And I don't want it to sound like I'm justifying myself, but the thing is, I feel like this is the only platform, okay, this and TikTok, the only platform where you can uh, grow your business, like tell people about your business. So I feel like I'm still going to do the bags haul. So if you feel like you don't like watching that, you can just skip this video and watch the vlogs or just watch something else. As for the girlies who like watching hauls, let's get started. <laughs> oh my god, I feel like this collection, I want to call it a collection. I feel like this bunch of bags, I got really, really nice bags. And the thing is, every time I go... Uh, to thrift I really take my time because I don't want to sell something that is at fault unless I have bought something and then I have noticed later after Nisha uh, Nunwa so yeah I feel like I took my time to get like some really cute pieces so every single bag that you are going to see today is going for 800 shillings and below slightly negotiable guys goes way thrifting is not for the faint hearted <laughs> It's a lot of work. Like for example, right now I came with these bags like two days ago. I had to wash them. I've not taken pictures. Like it's a lot of work though. I'm not complaining, but yeah, it, I feel like 800 is fair enough because the bags are really, really nice. At least that's what I think. <laughs> so yeah, um, kindly give the video a like, subscribe if you haven't. Let's get started. So the first bag that I got is this black bag that looks like this, absolutely gorgeous. I don't know what it is about me, but I love sling bags so, so much. I just feel like they will never go out of style. They go with everything. So yeah, <laughs> I'm obsessed with sling bags. In fact, I was actually thinking of taking this bag for myself, but I feel like I always do that and I need to stop by the way. I need not to watch last talk. <laughs> but I feel like by the alternatively, I could take something and then replace the money. So yeah, uh, so this bag absolutely gorgeous. It looks like that. It has a sling, obviously. And then this uh, extra detail that makes the bag even pop more right gorgeous oh my god i love this bag so much let me show you the inside and yeah i'm actually going to do this really quickly so that the video is not too long and then piano okay so the inside looks like that but then as i've said easy bags so if you see something that you like comment down below or just dm me on instagram my business page so yeah that will be easier so in a Kaivindani, very cute, brand new, Haina Delta that place here. Okay. Oh, another advantage, you guys, if you shop from my page, I can actually deliver to where you live. Yes, you had that right. Where you live, like for example, uh, from where I live to town is free, and I'll give you a pick-up point. Uh, but if you want the bag to come to the place where you live, you'll have to pay for it yourself. Also, come back to Kipotea, and I have sent. Nimesha Fika Town and then you give me the directions of where to send it and then Ipote that will be on you. Although Sidani mats what wana ibanga goods. <laughs> A really good advantage. So yeah, that's the first bag. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I love it. Uh the second bag I got is this white sling bag. Oh my god, I feel like 90% of these bags are sling bags. This is a white one, gorgeous. 
white in color haina dead as you can see absolutely gorgeous um the sling looks like that let me show you the inside as well because i feel like here for a bag the inside really matters looks like that also it's spacious enough it can easily easily fit a phone so don't worry about that how gorgeous is this though how gorgeous is that <laughs> so beautiful so beautiful all right so another bag that i got is this black bag that looks like this again another beautiful black bag the oh my god it looks brand new i feel like i've seen uh new bags in a zinakaibi like bags from the shop that looks like, looks like this so if you get a mtumba one you're assured of quality durability <laughs> and uniqueness as well because you can see it has like a gold strap which makes this bag even cuter let me show you the inside so wow Aki, this bag is so cute it looks like that and then so on the inside it has two compartments as you can see it's super super clean it's almost brand new nikamata is a tumiwa gorgeous 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 one compart one compartment at the center and i absolutely love it so this this is what the third bag actually let me name them by number so that uh if you see something you like you'll tell me the white the number three number one number two so the number one was the black one number two was the white one number three is this one so let's go to the fourth fourth bag so this is the fourth bag that looks so so unique i saw this bag and i felt like the girlies on instagram would eat this bag up because look at this beauty look at this beauty this is so unique i absolutely love it i don't know about you guys but i know i'm like quite com conservative when it comes to bags but sometimes i like being edgy i like being different <laughs> sometimes not all the time though so I saw this bag and was like absolutely gorgeous it looks like this but they don't be fooled i know it looks like it's small but it can fit a phone yes i tried to fit my phone here i fit with zuri sana so the inside looks like that also brand new beautiful 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 bag i love it so cute oh my god yeah Another bag that I thrifted, I told you guys I am obsessed with sling bags at this point, is this black basic bag. It looks basic but it, it also looks cute. I love the gold details. Let me bring it closer so that you can see. And then the strap looks like that. It's a, the straps are actually not long. So very cute. As you can see, Haina Dent at Akidogo. So yeah, so every time I go to thrift, I usually like, I think I've already mentioned this, but I like taking my time because the thing is, I also like to put my, myself, I, I like to see myself as the customer, right? So if you're a customer and you're buying something, I'm pretty sure you wouldn't want to buy something that you gonna dent or maybe add a Cause I remember this, this one cute bag that I saw, I'm still thinking about that bag because I almost bought it. And then I noticed that it required a dent up and no wonder people are not buying it because I was like, there's no way people are leaving this bag because it's so cute. And then the owner was trying to convince me to take it, but I was like, I feel like if I was a customer, I took it in a cup What's the point? What's the point of buying it? So I just had to leave it. So let me show you the inside. As you can see, super super clean. Haina dent ha taki dogo. Guys, these bags could easily pass for like bags that have been bought from the shop. No, I'm not kidding, guys. I'm not kidding. Because tell me why the inside looks this clean. You don't even have to wash it. But yeah, this is also another gorgeous, gorgeous bag that looks like that. I know it's pretty basic, but it's good. It's good. <laughs> Right. Uh, another bag that I got is this black bag. First of all, let's get into the prints of this bag. Absolutely gorgeous. It comes with a long strap that looks like this. And then I also love these details. By the way, you can also remove these straps. 
actually let me show you if you don't want them and then you will remain with a bag that looks like this gorgeous oh my god i love this bag so so much by the way you know let me tell you when it comes to thrifting sometimes it's a hit or a miss kuna time unezenda kama that time when i went i almost gave up because i feel like nearly i'm kalit and you're supposed to wake up early so nearly fiko ko by 8 and most of the nice things were already taken so the first time i actually this was the first bag that i got and i was actually quite disappointed because i was like now it's already nine what you come up here when you know i've not got any new bags so what's up and then i was like oh i hope aki ni kaomba to mungu ni sitoke uko kama sina bags then i decided to just take my time because i was not in a hurry and i am loving every single bag that i was able to pick so i don't know <laughs> yeah this is also another bag that is gorgeous let me show you the inside look so that they can get some shape uh huh the inside looks like this like i said all the bags are in great condition here is the other side gorgeous 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 again the price is 800 and below the prices are slightly negotiable because i'm a nice person <laughs> another bag that i got is this basic bag as well i'm saying basic not like an insult but like something that will go well with everything i hope that makes sense i love this color so much it looks different at least we give black a break right and then it has actually it's so cute because it has a black strap which makes it look different it has this handle that and this mimis are also removable you can remove them and just remain with the bag actually let me remove them so if you don't want to use the strap there's a bucket in a bag when you're going out for dinner and you don't want to have a strap ruining your outfits you just carry this very gorgeous beautiful <laughs> uh let me show you the inside kind of the inside was was it for me i love the fact that it has different colors inside looks like that which is red in color i don't know i i find this contrast to be so cute so yeah that's the other bag um another bag that i got is a chanel <laughs> although i don't know how original this is but i highly doubt this is an original guys i don't know do you guys know how hard it is to like find an authentic designer first of all how the hell did it get there because there is no way anyone in their right mind would donate an original brand designer or whatever those things are expensive as hell uh what do i know <laughs> that's just my thoughts so i'm pretty sure this is like um an imitation but yeah this is a chanel that looks like this absolutely gorgeous you can actually carry it like this if you want and it also has a strap um a sleeve guys when i say a strap you 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 guys understand it i mean a sleeve uh, but these ones are not removable so i wish they were like i just find carrying bags like this to be like so sophisticated so elegant i don't know so yeah but you can still carry it even if the strap is like hanging it still looks cool such a gorgeous bag i love the print the print here gorgeous the the brand by the time to have notice it's a it's a fake usha pita <laughs> And they're wondering, ooh, is that a real Chanel? Usha Peter, babe, Usha Peter. So, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous bag. Let me show you the inside. So, I don't know. I don't know, you guys. But, yeah, the inside looks like this. Pretty basic. Actually, just one compartment. And then it has this for the cards and everything else. So yeah, tell me this is not a gorgeous bag. No, 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 no. Tell me this is not gorgeous. 
it is gorgeous another bag that i got that i absolutely love this was actually a bit expensive it's brand new no when i say it's brand new i actually mean it because what um it's this the romoda bag by the way the romoda is um it's 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 like a famous brand i think i've had it somewhere the romoda yeah i have <laughs> And it's a bag that looks like this. Let me bring it. <coughs> I'm sorry. Let me bring it closer. You can see the colors. So this is cream. And then it has this other color that looks like gray. And then the straps have pink. And then there's also this um, handle that looks pink. Honestly, I was so tempted to take this as my key holder. <laughs> But then I realized if I removed it, the bag would look pretty basic. And I didn't be fair because the person who sold it to me also had an option of removing it and they did not. So, that's a bit mini use it. looks like that. Actually, what are you No, this one, I can see that in this one I'll negotiate because it was actually quite expensive. And that woman was not budging. Yani, by the way, I found a woman who had like really, really, extremely nice bags but bro those bags were expensive because tell me why and knows are bags for one thousand like one thousand what are, how much am i going to sell a bag with in Unua? a thousand it's a thrifted bag guys like this bag has already been used by somebody else and then when you see a thou then i sell it to a customer for like twelve hundred who is going to buy a thrifted bag for twelve hundred i don't know I don't know honestly that's just my thought process but yeah this was such a an adorable bag actually this is way better you can clearly see the colors oh let me show you the inside and the label as you can see the romoda right the inside super super clean high dent anywhere nothing nothing guys by the way if you buy the bags it could be delivered to you tomorrow I don't think there's like I, I don't think I'll be busy tomorrow. I could deliver the bags tomorrow. So get popping, get popping guys, get popping. <laughs> so I really wanted to like drift away from the blacks because I felt like I had bought so many black bags. <laughs> so this is another very cute minimalistic bag that I found. I was like, I feel like I need to take it. It looks like this. It's the prince. For me the prince oh my god this is so classy i don't know about you guys but i find such bags to be so classy and again with the strap you can remove it let me show you remove it and ubaki na bag kika hivi gorgeous gorgeous although i prefer it if you're on a strap such a gorgeous gorgeous bag again hyena dent anywhere the inside clean so clean one co compartment here and another one here and then now this whole big space again on the inside super duper clean love it i absolutely love it this other bag i felt like any bag honestly this was such a nice cool unique bag let me show you Bam. Bam. This is a, um, would it be called like a carry on? I am really not sure, but I feel like it could pass for a carry on. <laughs> I'm not really sure. But if you have a trip that you're going for two days and you don't want to pack too much, you don't want to carry. You know, the thing is, let me tell you, me, I, ha I actually have like a really big bag that if I'm going for a week or two weeks, it's very like it comes in handy for that but if i'm going on a trip for two days i don't have bags to carry clothes for two days and i'm not lying you guys so when i saw this i was like i feel like there are other people who also have similar problems so let me solve their problems first <laughs> uh i got this bag absolutely gorgeous i love brown you all know brown is such a classy color um yeah so it has this and it also has this this strap so if you don't want to carry it with this you can use this if you don't want to use this you can use 
this gorgeous such a gorgeous bag in good perfect condition let me show you the inside the inside looks like this huh and then it also has this extra i don't know what to call it, call it what do guys call this like an extra pouch 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 oh my god you guys this is really nice to add it but yeah and then also another good thing is that you can attach it to the bag so that it doesn't get lost like that and like oh <laughs> i think i had attached it to the buyer so you can attach it to a bag so that it doesn't get lost such a cool thing i feel like people who design bags are so creative yeah so yeah comes with that thing so i've already removed the clothes in your mana in a car but with the clothes here gorgeous 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 bag so another bag that i got is this black bag that i'm going to show you how to sell in a minute i know it looks weird it just has one strap like this but i feel like if you're into like traveling and this this will come so much in handy because it's a bag that you can put in front because of course if you are traveling like a tourist and you're moving to places you need to secure your things right so this this is such a cute bag so it's not a monkey bag by the way it looks it somewhat looks like a monkey bag but it's not because i like the straps is a so the inside looks like this can you all see how the gold is popping so cute so cute absolutely love it <laughs> We love it. <laughs> um, so let me show you how to sell it. So you actually put it like this, and then it's supposed to sit in front. Guys, I don't want you to see my messy house. It's supposed to sit. <laughs> it's supposed to sit in front like this, and then it also has these things that you can adjust if you need it to be like. Yeah. So that's how. Actually, this is so much better. This is how the bag should or is supposed to be carried very cute so the other bags that are remaining are bags that are from my previous stock that sequence of are but these bags are also like really cute so i'm just going to show them regardless so there is this black and white bag that cute so so cute again with the gold details qua zipper very cute then the hands the handles oh my god i feel like i'm tired the handles is in a car heavy they're actually leather very stylish if you ask me i feel like this is the girls that get it get it <laughs> the girls that don't don't but yeah and then i love the print black and white print will never go out of style fight me it will never go out of style so there's no need of showing you the inside because it's nothing special it just has one compartment and then all the material is like cloth like so yeah have that in mind so another bag that i had initially gotten is this zara bag that looks like this let me remove the clothes so that you can see so the bag looks like this and then you can fold it like that and then you carry it like that gorgeous gorgeous bag the last bag that i got is pretty basic it's just a black uh shoulder bag that looks like that i'm not also going to show you this the inside looks pretty basic it just has one compartment so the other bags that i've shown you because i'm not sure are pretty um affordable i think this is going for 400 or 350 i'll have to check but then sometimes i really forget how much i've bought something so i usually like write it down so that i don't undersell something so sometimes i forget honestly so i don't know if this is going for 400 or 350 but i'm going to tell you even the black and white one that i showed you i think that one is 400 the zara one i could take 300 very very affordable you guys there is no reason why you shouldn't be shopping from my foot page so we have come to the end of the video thank you so much if you made it until this far end oh my god thank you so much 
kindly give the video a like subscribe if you haven't i hope you have watched an ad i've seen somebody commenting on my previous video and they were saying that they don't see ads guys the amount of ads that i put on those vlogs <laughs> I'm even embarrassed to admit it, but I feel like sometimes YouTube tries to balance it out because, of course, if you give the viewers so many ads, it will not give them a good experience. And YouTube always wants their viewers to stay on the platform, keep on watching videos. So imagine if they... So I think it's a way of YouTube trying to balance the ads. You might not see an ad, but somebody else will see an ad. Um, so yeah, they're trying to balance it out and somewhat i understand what they are trying to do because peer mimi as a viewer i don't want to be bombarded but what is it called i don't want to watch a vlog and then there's like tons and tons and tons of ads even though i know that's how they get paid so what i usually do is i'll watch one two or three ads and that's it if i get another ad i'll just keep now because I, I i have really played my part and i've watched some ads so yeah that's why i'm always saying uh you don't actually have to watch all the ads that are on my vlogs just watch one or two and they are really some 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 ads are really like quite short so yeah thank you so much for watching i will see you on my next video bye